Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To view the touch keyboard settings in Windows 11, open the settings app window and then click the personalization button at the left side of the screen to show the personalization settings for your computer to the right. Then click the touch keyboard button to the right to show the touch keyboard settings at the right side of the settings app window. To set the size of the touch keyboard in Windows 11, use the keyboard size settings slider to select the desired size. To reset the size of the touch keyboard, click the keyboard size setting button to expand it, and then click the reset button in the expanded section that appears. This causes the touch keyboard to appear on screen. To close the touch keyboard in Windows 11, click the X button in its upper right corner. To change the touch keyboard's theme in Windows 11, click to select a choice in the keyboard theme setting button's expanded section. You can click the keyboard theme setting button to expand and collapse this section as needed. To apply a custom theme to your touch keyboard, select the custom theme touch keyboard setting choice and then click the edit button below it to show the custom theme settings. You set the colors for the touch keyboard's text, keys, and window by clicking the text, keys, and window links below the theme preview and then selecting color choices. To change the text colors, click the text link. Then click to select a color for the key text color and suggestion text color settings. To select a custom color, click the choose another color button to open the choose a color window. Click to select a color in the rainbow gradient and then use the slider below it to set its darkness or lightness, and then click the Done button. To change the key colors, click the Keys link, then select the background color for the keys from the Key Background Color setting. To set the transparency level of the keys, use the Key Transparency slider. To set the color of the Touch Keyboard window, Click the Window link. To set the Touch Keyboard's background, select a choice from the Personalize Your Background dropdown. If you select the picture choice, then click the Choose Your Picture button to launch an open dialog box that lets you select a local picture from your computer to use. After selecting a picture, to adjust the way it fits into your background, select a Fit choice from the Choose a Fit Settings dropdown. To change the background's brightness, use the Brightness slider. For both the picture and solid color choices, to then set a background color, select a choice from the Window Background Color section, or click the Choose Another Color button to open the Choose a Color window, click to select a color in the rainbow gradient, and then use the slider below it to set its darkness or lightness, and then click the Done button. To save the custom touch keyboard theme, click the Save button at the bottom of the custom theme settings. Alternatively, to reset the custom theme, click the Reset button at the bottom of the custom theme settings. Alternatively, to cancel changes, click the Cancel button. To return to the touch keyboard settings if needed, Click the Touch Keyboard link in the breadcrumb navigation at the top of the page. To toggle the Touch Keyboard background on or off, click the Key Background Settings toggle button to set it to either the on or off position as desired. To set the size of the text on the keys, select a choice from the Key Text Size dropdown. To show the Touch Keyboard to see your changes, click the Open Keyboard button in the View Your Changes setting button. To close the Touch Keyboard in Windows 11, click the X button in its upper right corner. To view the Typing Settings or the Language and Region Settings within the Time and Language Settings, click either the Typing Settings or the Language and Region Settings buttons under the Related Settings section. 
We will discuss these later in the Time and Language Settings chapter. To return to the Touch Keyboard Settings if needed, click the Back button in the upper left corner of the Settings app window. To close the Settings app window when finished, click the X button in its upper right corner. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.